Hi guys, Mark here with Walter's World, and we're outside the Titan Missile Museum in Green Valley, Arizona, right outside of Tucson, and we're here in beautiful southern Arizona, and guys, take my word for it, the purple mountain majesty behind me really shows why America is so beautiful. Arizona is a great place to visit, and what we're focusing on today is the top 10 things to check out in Tucson and southern Arizona, because Tucson's a really good base to see all these great things you have in southern Arizona. And the first thing you should see is right outside of Tucson is the Sonora Desert Museum. You go there. It's a living museum. Think of a cross between a zoo that has all the local animals, you know, javelinas and all kinds of stuff like that, um, you know, uh, mountain lions, all kinds of cool things like that, and you get to have a natural history museum as well. It is fantastic. You see Arizona for the last, you know, couple billion years. It is fantastic. The number one most important thing you got to see, it doesn't matter if you have kids or you don't have kids or you're coming by yourself, that is the best thing to check out. That's number one. Okay, second thing to check out when you're here is if you're it's actually right by the Sonora Desert Museum is Old Tucson. This is where they used to film all the old westerns. So you can go there and they still have the shootouts and all the movie stuff. And it's kind of kitsch. But if you want to go see like the old west stuff, it's definitely a place to go. So it kind of looks like the ghost town. And you can see the guys walking in their, their outfits and with the saloon and stuff like that. But it's not a historical representation. It's actually a movie set that they've changed into this. Okay. The third thing to check out, which is also right outside of Tucson, is the San Javier Mission. It's from the 1700s. It's the, probably the oldest European building actually here in Arizona. You go in and you really feel like, I mean, I used to live in Portugal for a long time. It was like walking into a really Catholic Portuguese church. It's beautiful inside, well worth going to. Uh, they, they, you know, there's guys there sell the fry bread, the, 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 the Native Americans that are here selling the fry bread right outside. All kinds of really good stuff to check out there. Number four on our list is Karchner Caverns. It's basically a little bit, how do I say, a little bit east of Tucson. Basically, it's a, a new formation, not a new formation, but there's caverns you can go through. They've only been discovered and released kind of for tourists to go to since the late 80s. Fantastic to go to um, if you like you know, climbing or hiking and going into caverns and stuff like that. It is totally awesome. You got to check that out. Number five, we're going into downtown Tucson. There's all kinds of art stuff and restaurants. You can see the Capitol building. There's a bunch of little museums. You can go see the University of Arizona, the, an old main that's there, you know, brick buildings. They actually had to build a brick factory or, you know, to actually make the bricks for the university because that's how it was done in the 1800s. Uh, there was no bricks actually in Arizona, but I mean, it's a really cool place to check out. So downtown Tucson, do the nice little walk around downtown and see the university. That's fantastic. Number Number six on our list is eating a Sonora hot dog. Guys, it is a hot dog wrapped in bacon with beans and grilled onions and, and, and salsa and some cream cheese on top and some mustard on top. Dude, it is fantastic. We went to BK's and loved it. It is awesome. You got to go there for that. Okay? I'm not really good. <laughs> incredibly messy, but it's really, really good. It's like a taco. And a hot dog had a baby with some bacon in it. Number seven on our list, if you see these mountains behind me, there's actually a lot of observatories. And a lot of people like to call um, Tucson, you know, the astronomy center of the U.S. Because you have Kitt Peak Observatory. We can go there and they have tours and you can see the viewings and stuff like that. And that's number seven. Go up into the mountains and see that. Look at the Kitt Peak Observatory. Number eight is the Pima Air and Space Museum. So you can see all the cool stuff that takes it to go up into the stars and see all these beautiful things. Definitely worth checking that out. That's number eight. Number nine on our list is... Whew, Tombstone, Arizona, where the gunfight at the OK Corral was. You can see where Wyatt Earp and Virgil and his brothers and the famous shootout went out. You have all kinds of people reenacting there and you get really, I mean, Old Tucson, if you don't have time to go to Tombstone, you can see kind of that kind of stuff at Old Tucson. But if you want to see the real town, go to where you see the gallows where people were hung, see where the shootout happened, go and you know, have your picture taken with all these things. It is a really fun trip. You can see the graveyards and all kinds of stuff. Really a neat place to go. That's number nine on our list. And number 10 on our list, it's a combination of Tumacacri and Tubac. Okay, Tubac's where you're going to go to get all your, you know, kind of kitschy pottery, but actually really cool pottery and copper works and stuff like that. It's south of Tucson, and just a little bit farther south of that, there's a nice mission at Tumacacri, but the really reason why you go to Tumacacri is you want to get the spices there, because guys, the food in southern Arizona and all the southwest is fantastic because of the spices. And when I say spices, I'm not saying, oh, it's hot. No, I meant flavorful spices. And you go to you know, Santa Cruz that's there at Tumacacri across from the mission, that's the place to go to get your spices, and it's fantastic. And guys, there's so much more to see in southern Arizona. You have the pipe organ, you have the 
the Pipe Oregon uh, Cactus uh, Park if you go to Southwest Arizona. Behind me, if you keep going up in those mountains, you have um, Madera Canyon, you can go and do some easy hikes in. You have Mount Lemon, where you actually go skiing. Dude, you go skiing in Southern Arizona, who knew? Wandering the desert, though, probably not a good idea to do at night, because there's all kinds of critters, rattlesnakes, coyotes, all kinds of things like that. You want to be careful about mountain lions, or, you know, all the, be careful with these things, because our friends that live here, literally, they find, oh, there's a mountain lion in our backyard the other day. So watch out for those things, but there's so much great stuff to see. Heck, I didn't get to talk about the Titan Missile Museum that's really right over there. So much great stuff to do and see here in Southern Arizona and Tucson. I hope you come. It's well worth it. If you want to learn more about visiting in Arizona, we have the top 10 things to see in Arizona, five things you love and hate about the Southwest U.S., all on our website at www.waltersworld.com. Also, we'll hope you like and favor our video, and we really appreciate all your subscriptions. So, bye from, well, it's Green Valley, Arizona, the Titan Missile Museum, and Tucson in Southern Arizona, because, guys, it is fantastic here. Bye.